Ladies and gentlemen, what is going on? Welcome back to a brand new video where my face is dark on one side and I think we should swap sides actually. Do we look worse? No, of course not. Anyway though, welcome to a brand new video on the channel. Um, while we're here in Krakow, one, I'm recording sort of the vlog that I usually do. I do more sort of summary videos um, or in real life videos in summer um, because I have more of a chance to get away when I'm not working and sort of 24-7 um, on the grind really. Basically going to work, coming home, and then sleeping and then repeating for the week and then getting the weekends off which I catch up with gaming videos. But it's a nice breakaway area to do with these in real life videos. We already done um, the Bean Boozle challenge, is that what it is? Um, I don't know if that's going to be live before or after but you can of course subscribe when notifications turned on to be notified of when it is actually live. And today anyway we're going to be tasting Polish snacks. Agatha is Polish so she can pronounce these sort of snacks for anybody that's curious to the name and how you pronounce it and for our Polish viewers. I had most of these already so I yeah. know what it like. Not all of them. We also have like a drink okay. as well. Cactus. That's, that's, oh, that's the same. So I can say cactus. <laughs> That was probably racist. <laughs> if you want to see more of this, once again, make sure you have that like button hit and, of course, are subscribed. Um, I don't know where to start with this. You know we should leave this for the end, should we? Okay, yeah. We'll leave the, we'll leave the drink for the end. Should we go like crisp sweets? Like something salty sweets? Salty sweets? Alright, so let's just go. I'm just trying to try this first. I'm trying it. You're trying it. So, this is Kauwa Królewska Osmakowanie which is basically. I don't actually know what it is in English. But it's like a little... Um... If you puke, I'll kill you. Oh! There it is! It says in English. Vanilla flavoured sesame halva. <laughs> That's what it is. Go. <laughs> sort of like vanilla and peanut butter. I'm gonna get to bed. Oh. <laughs> I don't know why people are torture themselves to buy this meat as a snack, but... I don't mm. like... No, the flavour is not bad. I don't like the texture of it. <laughs> It's like satin. Mm -hmm. Next up then we'll go with a bit more chocolate. The Prince Polo, apparently the best bar in Poland. Um, I've had one of these before now, but only briefly, so let's give it a go. It's supposed to be amazing. Don't chocolate ever, <laughs> well, I'll take a bite then you take a bite. Mm. Yeah. It's basically like a chocolate wafer bar, but with a bit more chocolate in between the wafers. And it's a lot smoother than... And it's Polish chocolate. A lot of these stuff, you'll definitely need a drink for if you ever eat Polish food. But it's not as hard as like the chocolate wafer bars you get in Ireland, but definitely, um, it is nice. It's probably my pe favorite Polish snack so far because these are almost ass. Next up is Twistos. That's what I said. Twistos. <laughs> what flavor is it? Sort of like, yeah. Mmm. Mmm. I prefer crisp. They taste a bit more like meaty than. They're basically like, I don't know, well, my man, anyway, Christmas gets these really like posh. It's sour crisps. cream flavored. Yeah, like sour cream. It's like a selection box of sour cream crisps. That's what my gets for Christmas. So that's what it reminds me of. But they have a bit more of a meaty taste. I don't know, maybe it's just me. I like it though. Because I'm more of a, like a crisp kind of person than like sweet chocolate. Mm. I like it. They're nice. I like cream though. Ooh. Next up then is the Zozol. Zozole. Zozole. Um, and like they're rainbow like jellies. Yeah, yeah, rainbow sour jellies. And let's see if Paul makes. make a mess. I'm doing it. Hmm? They're gonna make a mess. Are they gonna make a mess? Because it's the sugar on it. Alright. And I don't know. I mean, what? Can Polish kick it up from the rainbow sweets that we have at home? I don't know. Let's, oh, let's see. Well, I'm sure that they have these at home somewhere. I think I'll taste it. I had it in Ireland before with my Polish shop. Mm. Mm. Not sweet sour though. I would just say it's like sweet normal jellies you got, huh? I like them though. Mm. Not, I thought them were normal sour though. They're nice. Mm -hmm. mm. Next up then we have... Talarki. You like finishing my sentences for me, don't you? Because you can't pronounce it. I could say Talarki. Anybody could say Talarki. It's just like, inside, it's like, just pretzels. Yeah, okay. Well, thanks for spoiling it on them. What do you mean? They're obviously they're nice because they're really thin. Okay. They're pretty crunchy. Hmm. They're nice. Yeah, they're nice for like a movie or something. Mm. 
for like a, a match for a match. Just sit there with it. Reminds me of Christmas because my mom buys all these funky Christmas like her Christmas when people come over and then leaves them all out in bowls. Like that's what reminds me of. I think that's the only time I ever eat pretzels at home. Mm -hmm. Next. Patashi Milex Girl. Patashi Milex Girl. And. Um, what is this? It's basically chocolate. Um, no, it's like. It's foamy. Like foamy. Cream. Like it's, it looks really foamy. Like the inside looks like foamy. It looks foamy. Um, and it's just covered in no chocolate. Okay. Mmm. They're really filling, like you couldn't eat loads of them. Yeah. Get on there. They're nice. I probably wouldn't buy them now. Like, if I was going for chocolate, I'd still go for the Prince Polo. I'd probably pick them pretzels over whatever else we ate. Yeah. Vieske Zimniaczki. What? Vieske. Vieske? Zimniaczki. Zimniaczki. And it's with salt and butter. So, so there's just salt and butter on But it's salt and butter flavored. Really nice. I love it. They look normal like tail. The smell, they just taste different. Mm. I love them. I have like a real sweet taste in your mouth, so that was a real contrast. They actually don't have a sweet flavor. They do not. You know, they just taste different than normal crisps. Like no lace, no? They just taste different than them. Yeah. Lace, crisps. Well, that's the whiskey scrunch, wow, wow, whatever. Whiskey scrunch. I love this. My favorite. Last two things we have next, then, or last is the next quick bar. We got baby crisp, okay? Baby. Crisp. baby crisp. It's because they're made from like starch. Starch. Yeah, they're just really they like melting milk. Kind and of. then we have a next quick bar as well. But I'm pretty sure I've had like a cocoa pop cereal bar, so I'd have say next quick bar nearly. Yeah, we'll go for this. That doesn't taste like no, the no, that is not a medical cold thing. Cocoa pop bars. It's not like that. Okay, it's already slightly melted. Oh. I never had that before. I didn't expect that. You know what I'm Kinder? It's like a real coffee chocolatey biscuit. No, do you know Kinder, Kinder Country yolks? No. They're like, no, no Kinder chocolate. I've never really experienced, I never really go for Kinder chocolate. That's my favorite kind of chocolate. Wait, if so, someone probably knows what I'm talking about. The Kinder Country, which is like, you know them, what is it called? The, the rice, which is not like actual rice rice. No one asking me. You know though, it's called them. Um, Whatever it is anyway, that's what it tastes like. That's it, that's all you have to say. <laughs> No, it has it's like, kind of like a rice kind of yolk and it's just covered in chocolate and then like cream and all. That's what it tastes like. Well, it's similar to it. The inside is. I want to get onto my baby crisps, okay? Like, they're called. Like melt in your mouth. Crookie. 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 They're cheese flavor. flavor. Okay. Ew. Hello. Mm. I like them. They just melt in your mouth. Hmm? They melt in your mouth. Well, they also do prawn crackers in this pack. Imagine that. So I'd say these are my favorite crisps anyway, and then the Prince Polo, I, I, I feel you just can't. I like this. I never had it before. That's my favorite. You want to taste like in the country? My favorite crisps were. Well, these are my all time favorite. Like, it's my favorite. I always like them. But the ones, like new ones, I like it. Love them. So. Three stalls. And then to wash Ooh, it all down, is. we're going to go with this. Cactus. I guess a cup. I could have just drank that out of the can. Like no. a real man, mom. Where would you get them cups? Go there. Oh. Is this going to be horrible? No. It's green. Hmm. You're going to like it. It's really nice when it's cold. Okay. It's just juice, but I really like it. It's really like limey juice or something. Well, it's cactus. It's like watermelon. It's cactus. Cact it's from cactus. Yeah. It's, that's a flavor of it. Cactus. And it has limes in it. You know and yeah, ladies and gentlemen, that was all the Polish snacks we have for today. Um, I think it ended up costing us like, what did it cost us? Like 20 euro. 64. 20 euro and then 64 Good Polish, euro. whatever. Um, but yeah, it was actually really cheap. Um, if you want to see more videos like this, let me know down in the comment section below. Make sure you have that like button hit, subscribe button smashed. Smash the pieces. Literally get a hammer and smash your fucking screen when you're hitting that subscribe button. Make sure you have notifications turned on. And without further ado, unsubscribe. Look at you. Bye. Don't say bye. I'm not finished my outro. Yeah, uh, doesn't matter. Just go. <laughs> bye. Good luck. <laughs> <laughs>